going to be reviewing the Gillette Intimate Razor. It's for the private parts down there. I'm not going to use it for that. I'm just going to use it on my face to see how it does. Says I'm not sure about all the rules about shaving my private parts on camera. So I'm just going to put it to the test and let you know how it does overall. There we go. I always rinse my razor under hot water and then rinse it under hot water as I go. Helps keep the pores loosened up as I'm shaving. And I always shave with the grain and then go against the grain. Felt some pulling on my facial hairs right away, so I'm going to get some more hot water on it. Try to get this razor warmed up. There we go. Now that I've got it warmed up, it is definitely very pain-free, comfortable. Definitely not grabbing my skin or cutting my skin or anything like that. And those guards are definitely doing their job. Alright, I got all rinsed off here. Definitely a tiny bit of scruff. Definitely doesn't shave as close as a normal five blade razor, but of course that's because of the safety features, but overall it's pretty smooth shave, so no nicks or cuts whatsoever anywhere. But uh definitely just a tiny bit of 
not quite five o'clock shadow, but but it'll definitely get the job done for what it's made for, which is not what I'm using it for, but it feels the same as any of the uh, basic safety razors, like the uh, Pro Glide Shield or the Chill, which is also a safety razor. This one is definitely protective enough. It did not cut my skin at all. It's definitely safe to use. With that being said, I would definitely go with one of the electric shavers if you're going to use it for your intimate parts. Um, I definitely would not use a uh, handheld razor for that purpose.